The high-level U.S. military delegation in Seoul shows how much concern there is about the North Korean threat, and in particular Pyongyang's recent launches of Intercontinental Ballistic Missiles, or ICBM, capable of reaching the U.S. mainland. The U.S. Pacific and Strategic Command and the Missile Defense Agency held a joint news conference highlighting the importance of diplomacy. The most important starting point uh, is the diplomatic starting point. So uh, we, we hope and, and we work for a diplomatic solution uh, to, the, to the challenge presented by um, uh, Kim Jong-un. A very different tone from that of U.S. President Donald Trump earlier this month. North Korea best not make any more threats to the United States. They will be met with fire and fury. North Korea threatened it would fire missiles towards the U.S. island territory of Guam in the Western Pacific, a plan that was later put on hold by Kim Jong-un, who said he would wait to see what the United States did first. Tens of thousands of military personnel from the United States and South Korea are taking part in joint exercises. North Korea has condemned the drills and the attendance of top military commanders from the U.S. Pyongyang says their visit is seen as a sign that a preemptive U.S. strike against North Korea could be imminent. No one can vouch these huge forces concentrated in the South Korea will not go for an actual war action. Now, the military tensions have reached fever pitch on the Korean peninsula. Well, the military exercise between South Korea and the United States will go on until the end of the month. Many are wondering how North Korea will respond this time around. In 2016, Pyongyang fired a submarine launch ballistic missile in response on the second day of the contentious drills. A propaganda video released by North Korea shows images of what appears to be a ballistic missile zooming in on Guam. In a caption it says, we just wish U.S. policymakers should seriously think twice ahead of an obvious outcome. And time is not on the U.S. side. With the United States military now focusing on diplomacy, the message to North Korea seems to have changed, at least for now. Step Fasten, Al Jazeera, Seoul.